Hey everybody, it is Matt here. And in this video, I'm just gonna do kind of like a demonstration on what I think is the best way to get your website, your landing pages, your ads running, that kind of stuff with as little time and money investment as possible. That being said, there's more than one way to do this. And I'm not saying that this is the best way, but I think this is the fastest, cheapest, and most user-friendly way where you will be able to do it without the knowledge of Python and certain different you know, coding languages and software tools. So without further ado, let's get started. Follow this exact process and you can get full ad funnels going for 100 to $200. So the first thing you're gonna want to do if you've never run these ads before or you've never done a content funnel or let's just say you're starting from scratch, you just don't know what to do. What you're gonna wanna do is Find some competitors in your niche or just some competitors who are running the same type of ad funnel as you. And we're going to go to Facebook ad library. So if you don't know what that is, let's just search it up. And you go here. I've already clicked it over here, so we'll not do that again. And what could I do? I could do who is my competitor? I don't even know. But I know that like there's certain ads that are good for biz op business opportunities. And Adrian Morrison's one of my favorite funnels. So we can do two things here. We're going to be able to save his ads if we use a tool called Foreplay. Um, this does cost money. I'm not going to pretend it doesn't, but it costs, let's see how much it costs. $49 a month. If you're not going to pay $49 per month to make a successful ad funnel and you think that's too expensive, you're not going to make a successful ad funnel anyways. So $49 a month, and we're gonna be able to save the ads so we can save them inside our foreplay library. But we're also going to be able to see like what landing page or what he is running his ads to, because this is all public information. If you go into your ad library and you just kind of like don't see anything, it could be that you have to select it to the proper country, because I'm in Dubai right now in the United Arab Emirates. Some people just won't be running their ads there, so you can either go to the United States or whatever country if you know, or just collect all, or select all, and then we go back and do that again. So once we found that, like we see, okay, these kind of ads are working, but more importantly, we're gonna see like which kind of landing page that he is using. So it looks like you know this is a landing page. There's other landing pages too. If there's multiple ones, we might just want to go and see which one is the most common one and again just because their landing pages are working for them doesn't mean they're necessarily going to be working for us but this is a great way to get started so now we say okay i found the landing page this probably is the one that he's going to i'm going to take that link and i'm going to create a webflow account so just, I already have a Webflow account, but you could do this in Webflow, WordPress, ClickFunnels, it doesn't matter. And then you're gonna go to Fiverr and you're gonna click, if I wanted this in Webflow, for example, I'm gonna search Webflow on Fiverr and I'm gonna search something where this is an AED. So this would be, there's 3.7 AED and a USD. So if I click this one and I'll click on his profile and I'll contact him, you'd have to sign up but basically what I'm going to say, let me log in just to make this even more realistic. Well, I try to guess my password here. It might be over for me. But what you're going to do is you're going to say, I want you to rebuild this exact website and then send it to them and then send them your login for your Webflow or your WordPress or whatever. And they will really just rebuild this entire site for you for $50 to $100. Sometimes if it's pretty complicated, maybe a bit more. But instead of you trying to figure out what is working and, you know, going in Figma and making a design and try to build it and develop it and all that kind of stuff, you just want to do it just like I'm showing you here. Then what you want to do is two things. You can either go on your iPhone and have this kind of ad and just make sure we tailor it to what you want to say and then screenshot it and send it to yourself. Or you can do the exact same thing and say like, go to Canva 
here and tell them that you want them to rebuild this ad for you. So 39 AED, that's going to be like 12 bucks. I want you to recreate this for me in, in Canva. That's what you'll say. And then they'll send you the link. You make a copy and then you can just edit it from the computer like this. Very good way to test a lot of creatives. The other thing you can do is if the people you're spying on essentially have a lot of static ads, you can, you can go through and pay people to recreate them in Fiverr for you. I used to be a lot like very heavily in the newsletter game. So I just, you know, these are the biggest newsletter ads that are getting the most stuff. So, okay, I'm going to pay someone to recreate them. And now I can basically take their ad and run with it with my information. Don't try to do it all yourself, especially if you're learning, because you just don't know what you don't know. Go to someone who is presumably doing it successfully. Don't really assume, but if you've seen their ads over and over for months or years, they're probably doing it successfully. Take their landing page and tailor it for yourself. Take their ads and do it for yourself. Pay someone $100 to $200 tops for all of this on Fiverr, and it will save you a lot of time and frustration. So I hope that was valuable, and I will see you in the next one.